so it's me Nat, I finished from my exams and I'm filming a video for you today, um, very last minute, it's Saturday night, I've just come back from work, but I wanted to film this video so I had something to upload tomorrow because otherwise I wouldn't have the video that I've already filmed ready in time because it's going to take me a little longer than I thought. So anyway I have a small haul for you um, and I hope you enjoy. Okay, so the first thing I got the pigs kind of blends in with the floor. Um, I just got them a little, um, well not little, quite big, um, seagrass fumble in a really large size, actually it's pretty huge. Um, Truffle loves the trio of fumbles that I had and she's destroyed them, Minstrel's not bust. Um, but I thought I could stuff treats in here and then that might entice both of them to use it. So I bought them one of those, I have no idea how much the prices were, I'll try and pop them on screen but I don't know if I can find the receipt so um, I think it must have been about £3 maybe but yeah, um, hopefully they'll love that and I can't wait to stuff like treats in there. I then just got them the natural summer field, um, this is just like a herb mix, it's everything natural, there's pea, fl pea flakes in there but they can eat those. So the ingredients in there are perfectly safe for guinea pigs, um, so if you want to have a little read, there you go. So I just got them a bag of that. I then just got something I haven't seen before, so I got them some meadow hay cookies, and there's just a kilo of them, so I thought these would be quite cool. Um, they're just like compressed hay in little bales. Sorry, my window's open, I don't know if you can hear the cars going by, but um, they're like little hay compressed bales, and they're suitable for like... Uh, rabbits, guinea pigs, chinchillas or digus. So um, if we look at the ingredients, if I can find them. <laughs> so it just says the amount of different hays they have and then the back is full of information as to why they should get um, hay. Um, these are suggesting instead of hay, like an alternative, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to... Um, my parents splashing things in the kitchen now, but I'm just going to feed them to the pigs um, as like a little treat or something just for them to gnaw on, um, plus their hay obviously. Um, but yeah, I thought they were quite cool and I think they were like £3, which is really cheap because I know in pets at home they're like, it's not ridiculous, like £10, um, but at the pet hut they were really cheap, so um, I just got them a box of those. Then got a cat play cube, um, it was Ralphie's birthday the other day actually and I did go in buying toys for him but I ended up with all the guinea pig stuff but I got this cool cube, uh, as you can see it was only £2.99 um, so I thought I could um, give it a go with maybe the cats or the guinea pigs, haven't decided yet, um, if it's good I'll pick up another, it was only a £3 so definitely pick up another, I'll just open it and we can see what it looks like I guess. So as you can see, it's actually a really decent size, so I might actually give it to the cats, maybe. Um, yeah, I'm quite impressed with that, it's pretty big. I um, might pick up another one for the guinea pigs. If I put some newspaper in there, then it'll be fine for the pigs. Um, but I might give it to the cats, because I think they'll really enjoy that. So yeah, that's pretty cool, pretty impressive for three pounds. Uh, can't really go wrong there. <laughs> I then got a cat's tunnel, um, well, a play tunnel. Um, it is for cats, but I might give it to the pigs. I think I will give this one to the pigs, um, but I'm not sure. I think it would be a good toy to have on the grass. Oh, sorry, I just drugged the camera. Um, but it's got little balls on it, so I think I'll cut those off. But I'll open this one up as well and show you what it looks like. I think this cost me like £2. It was really cheap. So this is what it looks like. It's actually really big. Um, once again, I think the guinea pigs, all the cats will love this. Um, and because they were so cheap, I could pick up another one for either. So if I decide to give it to the guinea pigs, I'll buy the cats another one um, and so on. Um, but like I said, if I give it to the pigs, I'll cut off the balls. And lastly, I just bought the good old carrot play patch. I haven't bought this for my pigs. I think I bought it for everyone else's pets, apart from mine. So um, I thought, why not pick one up? Um, I don't know whether they'll play with it, it probably won't, but I think it looks cool. Um, I was going to get them the tree, but I'll see how they go with this, and I might go and pick up the tree. I know this was only like 6 99 which is cheap for this. Um, I can't remember how much it's on like via that, but I don't like that website. So um, I bought it in store, and I'm pretty impressed with it. You can also choose which one you want, because I was like a selection. I'll open it up and show you all, so you get a better gist. So this is what it looks like, you can actually see it is like covered in a lot of glue, like I'm, I'm quite disappointed by that, um, you couldn't really see it through the plastic, um, but obviously it's pet safe glue so it's nothing too bad for your pets, I just wouldn't want the kid pigs to like digest a lot of that, but I'm guessing they won't really chew it, I'm guessing I'll just give it a little nibble, but not too much, so you get the little carrots and you just like pop them in. I think maybe if I pop in like treats in there they might be more enticed to like pull carrots off. But even if they don't, 
look how cute it is. Like, <laughs> it was really cute and I think it will look cute in the shift. So thank you for watching. I'll have some new videos up hopefully soon. Um, I'm sorry it was a bit rushed and a bit rubbish. <laughs> I was going to put it in a vlog or in with another haul that I've got coming up but I thought why not do it separately just so you have a video so um, I hope you enjoyed and I will have another haul I'll have Lu Bu Shedsu always struggle to say that name <laughs> um, I ordered from her so I'll have a little haul of that stuff as well coming up soon so look forward to that um, and I will see you all next time bye